exist. Right. So once you understand what it is, and because that's like we, we don't understand what we're going through because we don't understand what it is. Once you understand what it is and you get it and you got it and you know that you are it and you part of it and you know what I'm saying? You know how to operate right. it and move it. You know what I'm saying? It's a fucking powerful thing that it is. You know what I'm saying? That right. it, it's just like I am, the power in I am. And you know what I'm saying? And making that your affirmation throughout the day because I am what I say that I am. I am just because I say that I am. I try to break you it down I am in, in existence than, because you know, it is. And like I be just I what I'm yeah. And I'm everything. Yep. Hey, what you say, Paris? I was saying I, I, I want to break it down further. You know, I am is the 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 simplest. That's no. it. You know that I like that. That that's that's what it is. Like I am, and nothing else. You know, because these six things. I so 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 we saying that is is what is is not, and you know you gotta be it. Like he was saying, you know you gotta control it, and you gotta be a part of it. <laughs> You ain't gotta control it. You just gotta know what it is. You gotta know it is something. You gotta you gotta know it to be. You gotta evidence. So, there's evidence to prove that something exists, so you call it it. With these numbers that we say is one through six, one through nine, where do God and numbers meet? God is in the numbers. The numbers are yeah, a part no, of God. No, no, I created the numbers. Bill on that explain explain yeah, that yeah, brother you created the numbers no 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 what man created is what you identify as numbers a symbol if I drew a bird and told you that represented number one for the rest of your life you'll draw a bird representing the number one so the number the numbers exist because they exist we come up with what we want to come up with as our own preference to Distinguish and classify each individual so you're number. That there are not six atoms in a carbon element. Yeah, I'm saying there are six, but the way you the way you identify the number six, the way it looks to us, they didn't draw the number six that same way three thousand years ago, but or or, or ten thousand years ago. So regardless so, of like you you thinking of multiplications and additions and subtractions when do you forget the value or quantity of something and go with what it is instead of what is not you know you, so you 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 you, you saying you you six, said you like six, you, you, you 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 saying six, like five. dealing with the source what you're saying is like dealing with the source itself instead of trying to break it down and figure it out? Yeah. Making it simple. Because that's what the flat earth did for me. It made things more simple. You want to know what that's like? Things not to be so complicated. You want to know what that's like? That's like, that's like? That's like somebody in a city and they don't know that the whole city is a simulation. Right? From day one, from their whole life. And it's kind of like a movie I've seen uh, where you, th where you where, where the whole city, your whole life is basically a simulation and you live, you're, you live in an enclosed environment. You don't know it. And then you hear a voice one day and everybody in that enclosed environment can hear that voice. And you don't know where the voice is coming from, but you know it's a voice. You know it's coming from somebody, but you you can never reach that person so because you're that inside. The stone that you have? Is that, what stone is that? What you mean by well, I don't know what stone that is. I don't even know if it is a stone. I just know one thing for certain that when you have a creation, you know something created. That's the voice. That's the voice. You said the voice stone. Hey, y'all get what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I feel. I, I, I'm, I'm trying to see where Paris going with this. Now, so you're trying to see, see. I, which, I got him. What, which, what was he saying? I got him. I got him. So, so, so maybe you looking time. at. So maybe you looking at. I'm trying to figure out which stone, which infinity stone he's trying to relate to. Because you were saying being conscious uh, of, of. Oh yeah, well, well, conscious. That's the mind stone. 
Okay, you okay to mind some. Yeah. So. Okay. I mean, I, I'm I trying to see if she on, has some treats. I build on like just the every, every, you know, I just keep building and building. I know you over there like, like, no, no, nigga, I ain't coming over there. I'm like, what's up, what's up, what's up, baby? Let me get one, let me get one. Joe Blow. What up with you, boy? <laughs> So what you what you trying to figure out, Perry? <laughs> What's up, my G? You know I'm out here getting it. I was, right, look, I was just looking at that that figure eight, you know, where it was explaining each stone or whatever. I ain't never really been into the Marvel or whatever, you know. Man, that, 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 know that's because people are blind. <coughs> like reality and like our everyday simulation life, like you were saying. Well, the thing is, brother, the thing is, Paris, is that they hide information in entertainment because because you got to think about it. They got to entertain us, but at the same time, there's an elite group of individuals on this planet that they got to they gotta pretty much stay in the know of what's going on. So they hide a lot of stuff right in front of our eyes that we don't even know what's going on, but they, but they, but they use reality in these movies because art imitates right. life. I know for a minute, oh, that's the gauntlet. And you see, that's that's, artificial, and it's, that's artificial and, and supernatural. Meeting. That shows what where, where all love them meet each other. Yeah, that's what I was saying. What, what, what's, uh, what's, uh, well, that's what we were saying. We were saying the God particle. That's that's say, what we were saying. What, what is your view on like, the combination of natural sciences, artificial sciences, and supernatural? How would they know about well, well, well. The view as far as that, man. Like, you, you, you get, you got to look at stuff, man, and, and and do your research. And that's what I do. I look at things and I compare it with things I know, and, and and I study up on things. You know, I I just don't run off babbling. You know, I like that's that's not what well, I do. I got, I got, a, I, uh, I got. I got. No, y'all gonna go ahead and take that one. Let us get them extra burgers, y'all. Okay, I had. You talking about some burgers and shit? No, I just lost my train of thought. Y'all don't, don't feel me on the supernatural science. No, no, I feel, I feel, I feel you, brother. I feel you, brother. I just was trying to get an understanding, and I don't know if it was just me, but uh, or or the other panelists, but I was trying to get a better understanding because because your mic is low, brother. You feel me? Oh, I, I, I have to. Yeah, and, and I'm here, dude, ordering something from from Wendy's somewhere, so you know. <laughs> yeah. I, Damn, y'all yeah. can hear me through the phone, bro. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, bro. Let me get a a, a Mick Double or something, man. Nah, that's my ride, bro. Y'all know I do right, this, man. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta bear with me, bro, a little bit. My yeah, I'm I, fucking, I, I'm fucking with you. You good, bro? Do, do your thing. Yeah, do your know, thing. Y'all yeah, know, y'all don't, y'all know I don't eat that meat. I don't. But you that. see, it just intrigues me because I fucks with the Infinity Stones. You know, I make that stuff and I deal with it. You know, and it, and it and it hit me. So in reference, which which Infinity Stone would that be on your hand right now? That's a head. That was the it's a Benin African mask, you know, West Africa Benin. Yeah. Ancestor. So which Infinity Stone could, could would you compare that to? Because I don't know which one I would compare that to. Um, I'm t I don't watch Marvel like that, so I don't really know like. That. I, I I I would I, I would say that's the soul the soul gem right there. It's green. That head. It's, it's an emerald. Yeah, you know the Emerald Cities and shit like, like you know. What well, an emerald? Uh, which stone was that? It was a, it was a, actually an emerald stone, but you know each stone has its own color. Also, right, right. along with uh emotions and shit. I think that was a mine. Matter of fact, it might have been the one Loki had in his staff. That was a green gem, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, and a, guess what? And guess what? That and since the mask, you go back, it was green that, that Loki had. Go back and watch the Jim Carrey the mask. It was a green mask, and it had green. Like, and, and it was Loki. It was boy. the mask of Loki from Jim Carrey. Right. Movie. It was the mask of Loki. Right. Now, now right. when you look at Loki, he was an actual uh god, an actual Greek god, like Hercules and all that other shit. He was a god of mischief. Right. So, so when you look at that, like. Marvel's doing something bigger than that. Like they making this god into like this evil villainous person 
and and people don't even know that like oh man that's just loki a character created by marvel no <laughs> like people man, y'all better do y'all research why why you think when, when, when the mask, why you think when uh, jam carry put on that mask he was getting into all kinds of stuff all kinds of mischief because that was the nature of, that was the nature of the mask now check this out though also in that same movie you had the dude the evil dude and he put the mask on he did something completely different because he realized the power that he can have with the mask yeah you get what i'm saying because no, with it, it but it was on, all no mischief though right 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 yeah yeah, that's kind of like a flip. That's kind of like a uh, a flip side of the conscious mind. Because once once the once the human mind is taught how to how to uh, harness and use and utilize that uh, upper level conscious mentality, then it becomes a total different breed of the person than a person that just stumble upon that shit and discover that shit and train itself how to use that shit. You know, they, they, they'll ease their way into it and they'll become, you know, noble more than likely. They'll become a more noble person than the person that was trained or taught by a, a general or something how to train their conscious mentality. That's where you get X-Men, the concept of X-Men and all of that yes, shit. Yes, yes. Even, like, even, 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 even what we're doing right now, y'all boys, like this, this, what, this, this, what it, this, what we're doing is, is the, is, is the it and it is very addicting. Like, because it is like it, it, it is a source of who we are, or and it is it. Like you know what I mean. Like 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 Huey just said. Like um like once you're firm with it, you roll with it. Like you know what I mean. Because there's nothing outside of it. So it's pretty much like getting plugged in. Because of the movie The Matrix, they're trying to unplug us. They unplug in the Matrix, but we have to. Once you take that plug out the Matrix, you you still got a plug in your hand, and you got to plug it to something else. You, you get what I'm saying? Now yep, I, I wanted I wanted to build on that because that 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 was I wanted to do a part of the panel tonight and uh Trigger got a couple things he wanted to talk about also now now when you look at that that that's augmented reality now people ask what's augmented reality now if you look at the word augment augments means to make greater than before you know to make to make stronger or any type of way now. Augmented reality is a technology that superimposes a computer-generated image, image on users, the view of the real world providing a composite view. Now, now when you look at stuff like the Lawnmower Man, Ready Player One, and we can even get deep and you can look at Wreck-It Ralph, it's a cartoon, but it's the same yep. aspect as the Matrix. You know, yep. jumping us out of video game, going into a virtual world, even that movie Shocker. The dude tra teleported through bodies by electricity. You know, and that's an old movie from the nineties, just like the lawnmower man. So, 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 when, yeah, yeah. So, 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 when you think about all that stuff, I sound like we got another panelist. You might need to come on. I hear somebody else. <laughs> but, but when you think about that, augmented reality is is is, is artificial intelligence. It, 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 far as what we know, is one of the most highest states. You know, because when we put on that helmet. Or when we put on that mask, or when we plug in, you know, we uh, we uh, we are in another reality, and 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 that comes to now. Who's not to say we we're not plugged in into a different reality? Who's to say we're not a part of a program? And and it might not necessarily be a program. Programs might be obsolete. This might be something bigger than a program. You get what I'm saying? When when you yeah, look yeah. at stuff like this, because because you got augmented reality, it is it, it comes in different ways. You got one way, right? Well, listen, you're right. You got one way where you can get plugged in, right? Plugged into this other world where you see things different, and 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 and, and you're able to uh create anything you see. Now you yeah, got man. another one. What where, where you put on a helmet, and the helmet is it takes you to a virtual reality state, but you actually move your arms. Now when you're plugged in. It, it, it reminds you of the Matrix because you, you you actually sleep and you're actually in the world. You know what I'm saying? Now, now when you, when you put on that virtual reality helmet, it's augmented reality because it's putting stuff there that you don't naturally see without the helmet. 
So, 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 so it's but, 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 but that's a made world because it's not like the one where you're plugged in. Now, the one right. where you're plugged in exactly. produces more power. Now, the one with that helmet, it only produces so much. And, 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 and that's, that's ready player one. Yep. It takes you to that's this oasis game, to, to where you can go to different helmet. worlds and stuff like virtual reality. Now, yep. you got another, another type of augmented reality, right? Now, let's say, uh, Altered Carbon. Y'all seen that show, right? Now, they actually take your consciousness because I'm going to talk about a Robin Williams movie. If y'all ever seen that movie, he was a funeral director. But yeah, the way he I did a funeral yep. was different. He did it yep. with memories. memories. He took your memory yeah, yeah, yeah. and, and put it on a disc program. and he showed you from yeah. when you was a kid to the day you died. You actually seen everything through that person eyes his whole life. Now, yep. that comes to that show, Altered Carbon. They actually take chips and put them in the back of your neck and to uh, self-made humans, I guess. They, yeah. they, 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 they made humans, I guess, like some Terminator type shit. Right. They actually put consciousnesses in the back of their neck the with a body. chip of a, of, of a person life. Like everything you knew from that person was in that chip and they put it in the back of your neck. So now we're looking at three different types of augmented reality mm. right and they all involve computers yep. so if you know computers if they already got you plugged in or if they already got that helmet on you or if they already got that thing in the back of your neck you don't think they trying to work on the next step to make your ass stay in there and enjoy that that's just like lust saying oh man you playing right. this video game so much and like you you so much into the video game, like God damn man, I love hey, this game. I don't want to leave. Hey hey, like, Anala, you are so deep because they they have they have a version of it right now, and they call it Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter because people live their lives through Facebook. Like they have an image. That it's a prepared. different reality than right. they really live. Right, right. Because I, for example, there's this chick that I met on Facebook, you know what I mean? Well, I ain't meet her. I knew about her, you know what I mean? On Facebook, she was so beautiful, you know what I mean? All this, but when you meet in person, she don't look shit like that, you know what I mean? Like, damn, hold on, wait a minute, like, you know what I'm saying? And then, yeah. when I think, then I thought about it, you look at the filters, they because guess what? They they got now with filters where you can make yourself look a certain way and add a brightness to your to your essence and your eyes and all that. You're right, but they, 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 they are in the works through that through the phones, and they, I, like you just said, what if they figure out an actual way to keep you in that state? Who's to say we not in that state already, you know? Right. Who's True. to say we not in that state already? We could be plugged in, and, and no lie, like, right? Y'all touching everything, looking at everything. Uh, Hell, just, just touch something. You'd be like, yo, this feels real. Right. Not knowing you you in this fucking virtual world. I mean, like I said, the list of movie goes on, and I and I just named a few, and I can keep going. But, no. but but if you look at it, all of them are talking about the same fucking thing. They just doing it, showing it to you in different ways. Look at the movie Get Out. Get Out did the same thing. My point exactly. And uh, and, well, and, 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 see, and see the Matrix behind Get Out, right? The Matrix is not an actual computer world, but it's actually uh, imagine your mind or, or you being stuck in someone's body, but you know your whole life what you look like and, and who you were. And you wow. didn't know that you were out your body till you actually looked at the mirror and realized like, yo, this is not me. It's like wow. having plastic surgery and having a whole different face change. But no, they actually oh, shit. Tell Hey, they oh shit. They just came out a movie, um, not a movie, but a song. I don't know if y'all boys on the radio with Chris Brown and that other white dude that hey, I mean what's the name body? Chris Brown Brown's body. You get what right. I'm saying? Right. All this shit is in reference to augmented reality, the the matrix, all that stuff, brother. That's why I talk so much yeah. about like a lot of yeah. people don't talk about it, but I talk about it a lot. And trigger, you know I do, right? Trigger. So I talk, oh, yeah. I be talking about artificial intelligence and technology because that like we we looking at the humans and all this but we don't know y'all don't know man technology is making their own programs and, and they taking over the world Yo, <laughs> you know what check I'm this out check this out what if get out was a little spoof of the little technology junk they're trying to do and what if that's like 
What if that's like a little? What if that's like a little, a little uh, Easter egg, a little insight on them? I think that they actually run a test on people to try and try and run tests on this augmented reality with the computer chip and the conscious mentality. Because think about this for a minute: the the the, the sunken place, the sunken place, and get out. That shit seemed to me like your consciousness is inside of your body looking out, looking from looking looking through your own eyes from the inside out, and you not in control of your body. You just along for the ride, watching everything. That's what the second place seemed like to me. Like so imagine right. yourself, imagine you being trapped inside of your own body. Inside of your own mind, and, and, and at the same time, that's like, not your mind. That's not your mind. Yeah, like you're not in control. Like something else controlling you, and you just watching every damn thing. Like it, it, that's it's like you, this. Like me. Yeah, you wake up one day and, and realize you're not who you say you are. Or, or you can look at that movie with Nicolas Cage. Uh, it was a movie where it was Christmas, and he woke up. It was the same day. It kept repeating itself. And it was like, man, I, I know I done did this stuff and it's repetitive. What's going on? And the whole movie, he kept on repeating the stuff over and over. And then you got that show, like I told you, Alter Carbon. Every time the dude wake up, it's 100 years later and he's in a different body. And originally, he was an Asian person. He was a mongoloid. And it ended up becoming a, 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 a female, then a, then a, a, a Caucasian, you know. And, and, and he kept his whole perspective kept changing because he had to adapt to, to, to the race of the body he was in. That's you know what I'm saying? Not knowing. Uh, yeah, like, 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 this, like, like, like this lady, right? This lady on, on, on the show, right? She, uh, she woke up, but she was supposed to have been like, I think a six or a 12 year old girl. She woke up, she was an old ass lady that was like 40, 50 something. And she's looking at herself like, Oh, what's going on? I'm an old lady, you know, and that shows you the deception there. They just throw man, anybody in anybody. Hell yeah, man! And that's also and then, proof that that's also proof that the spiritual world is true, is real. Because that could just be a, a twelve year old girl that that ended up jumping into that that woman's body, and that woman's spirit, so spirit, then went on to stay into the spirit world. Like I think that shit possible too. Motherfucker, motherfucker, well, look at the movie Ghost. Look at the movie Ghost. Look at the movie Ghost with uh with Whoopi Goldberg. It's the same. It's the same principle. It's the yeah, same motherfucker, lose their way back. Dog. Motherfucker lose their way back home. They ain't in their body no more. Somebody else took over that motherfucker. And that's why people change. People are totally different than who they who they was before. That's why. That's what I think they doing with these musicians, man. Yeah, they got that new saying say everybody's being cloned. It's because they hold perspective right. and outlook on life is changing. Mm -hmm. Yep. What if somebody told you all your famous superstars done housed many souls? Like, what if Jay Z? What if Jay Z? And I just, I just use him as a reference. I don't know nothing extra about this man. And I just, he just collateral. He just collateral just because he he fit the he fit the bid. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't picking on the nigga. But look, what if Jay Z actually? His the original Jay Z spirit dumped passed on and, and been trapped in the spirit world for, for a long ass time. And he, now, actually, you know, he actually just a vessel that been housing multiple other spirits. And, and, and Jay Z just basically a vessel now, he's not even himself no more. He's just a vessel. Well, you know, you know, they got you know, they got a picture supposedly of Jay Z, a and how he looked in a doppelganger. They got a picture of him or how he looked in the 1930s. Like there was yeah. another. Like, you know, there was, was an like actual. Jersey, yeah. like, let, let me show you. York. Let me show you that. In New York. In New York. Was still in New York. So that shows you there. You remember how I was telling you about uh, Tesla and all them? They found a way to transfer people through time. And, and I was reading up on this article. It was saying basically they set it up for Trump to become president in the future. Tesla made with uh, Trump's great uncle, great, great uncle. Yeah, well, shit. They talk about him back to the future part two. Biff, Biff was yeah, Donald Trump in that movie. Yeah, yeah, can, yeah. I know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If they can set up Donald Trump to be president, which I know damn well they did, I think they can set up Jay Z to be the best damn rapper. Yeah, this man probably is a damn agent. Probably been an agent in all his motherfucking lives. This motherfucker might be a thousand years old. We don't know. 
This motherfucker Jay Z probably uh, probably is Illuminati. Probably the original fucking one of the original black listen, people. Listen, listen to the way he raps and able that to goddamn to say this show off the top of the head, bro. That nigga probably been living forever and looking the same forever. And we just yeah. don't know that shit because we just live normal life and normal life. Because he, he he was changing his appearance with the decades. You got the yeah, 80s. Yeah. Everybody was going to change the time. And, and, and and hey, you got to realize this, man. You got to realize this. We've been here since forever. Right? Yeah. Ain't no time like no time like now, right? And you got to realize we all came from the same little nut jail. Right? Exactly. And was able exactly. to form into what we look like. So the way that we form is part of our memory bank. This is what they do. This is what they all this there it is right doing. There. It's what they doing with our uh, mind control. This is how they control our mind because if we can put in our mind that we was a slave. But we're decoding it, but we're decoding it. So, so, yeah, so, I know, but, so but, the, but we decoding it when it's the massive though. You got to know that we are microbes. That, uh, that, 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 that's why that's why we doing saying? this panels. We, we, we're actually letting right, the people wait, know. We waking them up right, to wake people up. Yeah, exactly. So that's why I, I ain't disagreeing. I'm I'm saying this is what they got going on, though. This is what's going on. What they're doing is they trapping our mind. They getting our mind to realize that we were slaves, right? So so they don't care about us uh, talking about that, right? Because that plays into their part. Because that goes into our memory bank. And then that goes into the memory bank that we was working. And you know what I'm saying? All of this shit plays a part. So when we come back, and shit continues. You feel me? Instead of us knowing, like, like we was able to do Superman, we go, we, we got Superman in the in the mind of that was a TV show, and it was make-believe. You feel what I'm saying? So we can't never be the Superman. You feel what I'm saying? But they will be. Because they know it's reality. Or those who know this shit. Motherfuckers That's like deep. David Copperfield or motherfuckers like Jay Z, who know these things. This is how they're able to 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 uh to reach these heights in life. Let's check this out. Hey, that's Jay Z all day, bro. Let's that's Jay Z all day. That's Jay Z. But check this day. out, though. Check this out. I just want to say this: knowledge, knowledge, uh, knowledge, uh, um, actually frees you. That which is why they say knowledge, the truth will set you free. Knowledge, knowledge will free your conscience to where you, will, to where you, will, you will look at the world different, and you, you, will, you will manage the world different. So it's like, it's like if a person, a person on the subway tell you aliens going, going to attack tomorrow, you gonna look at him like he a crazy motherfucker. But if two hundred motherfuckers come up to you and say aliens going to attack tomorrow, your ass gonna get on your, your ass gonna get on your shit and, and try and try to prepare at least a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So like. So like with Jay Z, at the end of the day, this dude like, well, I'm not even just talking about the real Jay Z. I'm talking about a, a person in his in his shoes, with him being a a person of a, of a, 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 a status that that basically got a, a dominating position in the world today, you know. So so when you talk about these leaders and these influential people like Donald Trump. Like if these niggas really do, if these niggas really do know that reincarnation is real and we just trapped and we just we just basically don't know our real our real abilities and they keeping us from knowing our real abilities. We got to think about shit from a different different perspective. Now we got to look at everything objectively. Now we got to look at right. exactly what they put in front of us. Uh, uh, we got to look over everything that we what we, what we actually already know we gotta look over all of that shit too we gotta double check all of that shit because for all we know through all, all of our time alive they've been leaving us clues on what the truth is and we just don't know we just now realizing that the truth is real and it ain't what we've been told now but we if we go back and look at certain shit we we we'll be able to put some shit together that we probably didn't put together yet and that's why that's why these bills are important you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, this shit will reach a motherfucker's ears whether it's two years from now, and they'll probably be able to add something to it and put everything in perspective the way it's supposed to go. You know what I'm saying? So shit like that is important. You know, these Illuminati, all these Illuminati motherfuckers, they figured it out. Knowledge is power. When, once a person knows his capabilities and, they, and their abilities, they go about life different. If a motherfucker told you that you got the power to live forever, you would think he crazy. But if 50 motherfuckers told you you got right. the power to live forever, your ass would be going out, your ass would be going out your way trying to figure that shit out. And you'll you, so you, you look at life different. You'll look at life That's totally so different. 
That's so deep, bro. That's so deep. And I think I think it's just as simple. Uh, yeah, man, but shit. I think it's just that simple, y'all boys. Like you just put it, uh, trigger. Like it's just as simple as somebody telling you what's up because it's just like this. Like let's let's just say aliens, for example. Let's just say UFOs. Like mother, you got a you got you got a billion motherfuckers think UFOs are real, but and until the elite confirm it, it's just speculation. So it's like everything is everything. You know what I mean? Like. Every, that bro, like, I believe that we live in a realm in a world where everything is every and anything is fucking possible because when we was growing yep. up elementary school they told us hey you can be anything you want to be and you're like well, yeah, oh yeah like you know what I mean I don't know about that but think about it you got fucking a man fucking turn himself into a fucking woman now so think about that like yep. a man cut his dick off yep. I'm going to tell you like yep Go ahead. I'm gonna tell you like this, bro. We all grew up watching Dragon Ball Z. I don't give a fuck who you is. Right. If your if your motherfucking ass seen a motherfucker go up the street and throw a fireball from his motherfucking hand, <laughs> right. and if you seen that shit one time, your ass gonna break your motherfucking neck trying to figure out how he did that shit. So you right. can try to do that shit. Like, cause you seen that shit. But if you go tell the motherfucking coffee shop, yo, I seen a nigga throw throw a fireball from his hand with my hey, own two keep eyes. That, up. Keep that, you, up, that motherfucker I swear you crazy. Swear you ain't seen a damn magic trick. He'll never believe it the way you do. He'll right. never believe hey. that shit the way you believe it. Hey, 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 Paris, hey I want to build. I want to build on that. I want to build on that what you talk what you got up right now knowledge. Um that's what, what I if, say he over there doing some shit and he got a torch and everything. <laughs> hell yeah, I'm, I'm trying to see what he got going on. Yeah, yeah. He fucking with that black magic. Hey, you on mute. You on mute, Paris. Hey, you on mute. Take your take your thing off mute, man. Yeah, Paris, you on mute, man. Oh, uh, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. No, nah, you low. I had to cut it down because of the torch. All you was gonna be hearing the torch all the time. It was gonna fuck up the convo. Well, so, turn it up a little bit because we can't hear you. What you over there doing, man? What you over there building, man? You over there looking like jewelry, man? I make jewelry for a living. Oh, okay. Oh, you make crystals. Word. You make crystals and stuff like that. You make grills. Oh yeah, he's yeah. doing that. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, he... Got hey, but I can on. turn it into a grill if you want one. But yeah, on this knowledge tip though, yeah, with the stones and shit too though. That's a uh, tiger's eye. I mean, yeah, amber, man. amber. But uh, hey, with the aliens, do y'all feel me that? There are only one race of people to puddle and all other races are aliens so your brother uh, I get, I get could be saying. an alien to this puddle your cat and dog could be an alien to this puddle yeah so, yeah basically I, I, basically, I, I, basically when you say the alien in that aspect basically saying they don't understand the culture or they will live in this different that's an alien now you speaking in an alien in that aspect Yeah, we are all human, but we all have different cultures and, and different different understandings and beliefs on way of things. Now we all might have similar outlooks, but now when you're speaking of an alien in that aspect, the way you said it, we're all humans, but we all come from different. Hey, what if I tell you? What if I tell you culture came from? Yeah, what if I said? What if I said civil, ancient civilizations only developed culture after they came to this puddle? That's deep. After they came here, before they came here, they was all the same. They all was of the same cloth. Like, what if they came here and they said they were separated and they came up with different ideas among themselves as they That's were separated? Deep. That's deep. And they That's and they, and they, 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 they developed what we call cultures. What but they all originate from the same bring, one area. Bring the silica trees into that. Hey, hey, now check this out. I'm going to build on that trigger. And I said that what you're saying right now, I said a long time ago. 
we are looking for like aliens and stuff. Like, what if, what if, not what if, but we are the aliens. Like, you look at a bird, you look at a spider, you look at a snake, bro. Like, we we are the aliens that we're looking for. And I honestly believe that when they show you the uh the uh the little space gray alien and all that stuff and on pictures, I believe that's that's a that's a damn a, that's a damn um smoke screen distraction because I honestly believe that the so called aliens like we were saying earlier. Look like us. We are them. We are they. You know what I mean? And I think the aliens, when they show alien like autopsy of aliens and shit, and I think only one. I think one or two things, man. Like either, either it's um, either it, it, it really look like that, and it's a dead one, or you know what I'm saying, and the shit's really real, or you know what I'm saying, it's a person that they actually fucking experimented on, and that motherfucker. Oh. Dead. Oh, you right. I said, and I it just ended too. up it's dead, like a throwaway, like shit. He's fucked up. He's fucked. We can't use him no more. We gotta experiment right. on somebody else now. And he right. just looked like that now. But he started off as a regular person. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I I know one thing for sure, man. It's some it's some fucking military motherfuckers files that just get fucked that, that that be going to places we ain't never heard of. And these motherfuckers be doing shit we'll never know about. And they in the United States military. They can't talk about what they do for the gov for the for the uh, country. They gotta take oath really by that, that shit. Secret. They can't talk about what they do for the country, bro. It really ain't that secret, man. Go ahead, Paris. Speak up. I can't hear you, bro. I was saying it's really not that secret what they've been told in the military because it's simple stuff like, like how they say uh, satellites don't exist in the flat Earth. Have right. you heard that notion before? Yeah. They don't. But they do. They call balloons. In the same way they uh, refill jet planes, uh, airplanes in the sky. Talk to them. They Talk refill them. Air, uh, air balloons in the sky the same way. Talk to them. Word. You know, that that and, makes and sense, that's too. what I'm saying. Like, civilization. Bro Sanchez hit it on the nail when he said uh, civilization was the end of your ass. Like, that's true. All of this culture, all of this, this Bantu... Uh, Ancient China, all of this shit was to fuck you because you, you took the power away from the woman and you didn't know what to do with it. So we created the, the stones. We created artificial science to perpetuate that. That's how the man is able to give birth to a child because he nutted in his own mouth. I'm telling you, that shit's fucked up and sick. What? When they do that shit. How a, how a king succeeds each other. You don't want to be a king. You don't want to be a ruler. You got to suck to other him. king's dick, eat his cum, chew his dick off, and swallow it. Because now you've taken over. You are the now, now, according to what culture is this, brother? But no, 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 no. I'm looking at the etymology of the words. They're not going to tell you that because you're not going to follow nobody that did it. Right? Bill, go keep building. Talk. Expand on it. Bill with us. Explain that. I needed a yeah, but you got me. Ain't nobody going to follow that. So they do that behind. You know, no, no, I, I get what you're saying. I just didn't want to cut you off no more, brother. Go ahead. Man, what the fuck? I, I, done, I done lost it. But uh, yeah, like, so the aliens, like, when I say your brother could be an alien, I mean, our mothers was raped, right? So then that means... We got the alien in us because we want money, we want a car, we want to be able to provide for our family, right? And if you don't, you can go live in the mountains and be good, right? So the only way to get up out of this is to build a commune. And we did that in the 80s and the 70s with Jim Jones is the distraction. Jim Jones was the, the, the media. Uh, Waco, mm. Mm. real shit. Mm. But it was still a distraction. Mm. I'm telling you, the Black Panthers. We we all you two talk about is uh, conspiracies on the FBI and CIA going into the the food programs and shit. Like, you know, these, these niggas is starting some terrible shit. You know, they. <laughs> the so once right. you destroy that, but I'm, I'm veering off from the alien thing. The, the man that, that sat there and took the money 
to destroy his own people was your brother because we grew up in the same world, the same states, you know, regardless of whether it was the Chinese state or the American state. We want money. We want food. We want all of that shit. And the only way to get it is for you to sacrifice yourself for something else. And that something else <laughs> you know, you, you don't want to sacrifice that other than yourself, but they try to tell people that they sacrifice their families. When they don't, they sacrifice themselves. Like, their families do. Well, kind of like a blood sacrifice, but not necessarily yeah. you're taking from the blood. You're actually doing a, a, a self-sacrifice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, they, they might say, we got your family, but they going to take care of your family, but you, you are for them. You know, they don't care about your family because they're going to, they're going to make you, it's, it's like, it's like when they pull people off the streets who have no family and they say that they can go make them do anything they want. Sometimes those are the people who they don't want. They want people with families, you know, so they can threaten you. And and that's why that's why I'd be like when you go into a seven eleven, they got foreigners behind the counter. Nothing wrong with that. But the mentality of you in this country and you can go back to your country and, and live like a fucking thousand there and be shitting on the next door neighbor. You feel me? Like America is the shit, but we need to create our commune within this place. And it's gonna be a lot of bloodshed, like the forefather said. You know, the, the blood. My point is this: like, this is how I feel about it. We think America is the shit because we only lived in America for a while. I'm gonna speak for myself. I ain't never lived in the world. But guess what? Though? Like, if America ain't the shit, then you are gonna be fucked up because ain't nobody else got the guns like we do. I don't know that. We say that America going to fall, but it's not. Me personally, fall. I don't really know that, though. I don't really know that. Yeah, because we don't know what them other countries have. Because you want to know some? You want to know some? I ain't never heard of Canada being in no war. Canada got their shit together, you ask me. Canada got some shit that they have, they, have, they have slapped the dougie off everybody. They don't fuck with Canada. No, 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 because they are Canada. Canada, China, they all everybody. Everybody is everybody. Like, they all in cahoots with each other. That's what the, yeah, that's true. The heavy is the head that wears the crown. And who has the crown? The prime minister. The the uh, the Pope. And the presidents of the world. You know, the name changes. Like, uh, King uh, 40, 432 Drop told you, Preston John was just the name. You know? Heavy is the head that wears the crown. And that's some that's some that's some real shit. That's some real shit. Family to be able to be in the mix for so long, you have had to have done some things to people, you know. And that's when Bro Sanchez is saying, like, when you testify, you grab your nuts. You grab your nuts when you testify. Like, if you fuck up, we gonna get your nuts. So. Ain't no more fuck ups gonna happen. You feel me? Like we right. that off at the at the mark. But you can't grab a woman by the nuts. You know? You right. Hey, I'd like to add on what y'all was saying about the United States. Uh what you saying the United States is the shit? Yeah, it is. Yeah, a piece of shit. I'm telling you, piece but of fucking the only shit. reason why I say that is they a piece of shit. If it let me tell you this. Shit. Let me tell you this. They a piece of shit. They a piece of fucking shit. They ain't shit. They a piece of fucking shit. United States ain't even a fucking country around here parading like they it a fucking a country. And it exactly. And they are like they over there bombing these fucking people, acting like they're country. They ain't shit. But some we fucking bullshit. Just was they talking about that at the shit. beginning of the build. <laughs> Don't lie, yo. They ain't shit. 
The motherfuckers ain't shit. But some I mean, of course, it was a corporation. Look who you got as president. Hey, hey, check this out. This they hold excuse for bombing the president. They've been a corporation. Go ahead. Been they hold point of bombing the whole fucking time, man. Not just to my Trump knowledge. Out. To my knowledge, yeah. the shit was about. To my knowledge, the, the shit was was more so along the lines of uh, the Syrian the Syrian ruler bombed the person the people who had something to do with him him being at jeopardy at some at one point or another and him almost him I'm almost sorry. getting fucked up and he and when, once he once he came out of hiding once he came out of hiding he he he, he wanted to kill a whole bunch of people that had something to do with the shit. And, and then, it's been going on for seven years. Right, right. And then the United States come in and say, okay, you, you basically fucking up your people for fun and having fun doing it. I'm going to come over here and fuck you up just because you did that to your people. So they, so the United States, basically, they use anything for an excuse to go and, to go and, go and run and, and rescue people. So when you think of Captain, Captain Planet, the that's how the United States government want to be. The United States government want to be Captain Planet. You know what I'm saying? So that's why that's why that's why they want uh that's why they want a whole abundant amount of soldiers that's expendable because they want to be Captain Planet. They want to fucking rule the world, save the world, be the corruption of the world all at the same time. I think I think America I think America I think they the same shit that they gotta realize they the same go my bad, go ahead, Huey. Uh, they doing the same shit that they just like they want to do. They fucking uh, he don't went out. I can't hear him. We can't hear you, Huey. Huey, you went out, brother. I I can't even hear him. He got his mic muted. If we wasn't the shit, who would be the shit? You know, under this patriarchal, you know, system. Patriarchal hey, system. Hey, 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 and that's easy to explain. You look, at, you, you look at South America. South America is on its way to being the next United States. You got, I'll tell you you got, the, shit you got is. the UAE, which is United Arab Emirates, on its way to being the next United States. Saudi Arabia. I know who the shit is. Arabia, is. India. You got all them countries trying to got them. They they're doing their thing because they're doing all these international trades. Ooh. And while Trump being president, he he's stopping all these trades and stuff. He canceling America out on trillions of dollars and is giving the these country. other countries the uh the potential to to become bigger than the United States. Now, if you look at Africa, right? Africa, right? Long now, Af Africa, they 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 talking about building solar panels over there. Now, just imagine if they build a whole like solar panels throughout the whole Africa. You know, Africa will have the power to power the whole world. Man. Now, now Man. I'm not I'm not gonna give you the mathematics, but but you can do your research and, and you will see that. Well, see the thing with solar panels, it absorbs energy. Now, to me, I I I like it. And it collects heat, and it. Kills. That's what the energy is. The energy is heat. wind power to give to give a charge to the battery. All of those things, like this green energy um, craze that we got going on, is a, is a scam. It's killing our animals, the animals that are natural to this planet, versus the predators. Well, well, well. well so to, to me, I, I think the solar panels doesn't really have an effect on anything. I mean, it, it's 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 sitting there. And, no, 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 no. I'm gonna help you out. Just think about it. Uh, I mean, I mean, I, I don't, I don't uh, see the effect. Uh, three, four, three, four, five, six acres of solar panels collecting yeah. sun. Well, what, well, well, now look, well, hold on, I'm gonna stop you right there. Now think about that. Now, now, just think about nuclear plants and all that shit. It's the same thing. It, now, now, the reason I say that it's the same thing, but it's a cleaner, it's a cleaner way. So, 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 it is going green. It, it, it's, it's just like when you use biodegradables and all that I'm stuff. You off. What were you saying? Now, 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 I'm I'm saying now, you you look at stuff like uh, you look at nuclear pl 